Hey everyone, short video today, unboxing uh, format here. Uh, it is a knife video, so if you've been waiting for <clears throat> one of those from me for a while, then uh, here it is. I'll follow up with a more detailed review of, of course, your commentary. Sabenza, large, opening it. Tricky on the boxes here. From a new spot. I've been waiting for this one for a while. It's been on the pre order list. So you can clearly see that it is a Spider Co. And I don't have one like this before. And let's see. Okay. Decent bit of weight to it. Pretty cool. Wow. So this is the uh, not quite a sprint run uh, Mannix knife in uh, tan with uh, CPM M4 steel and G10. It's pretty nice. It's got a nice uh, ergonomics to it. Crazy sharp. And uh, I'm waiting for this one for a decent amount of time. I have a couple other ones that I've waited, at least one other one that I've waited a way more length of time. Uh, let's see here. Here's the uh, model number. Basically, the Maddox to Coyote Brown or Tan Color with the M4 steel. Play with the lock here. I don't. This is my first uh, Maddox style. Uh, I guess the Spider Co calls it the ball lock. Maybe could be wrong. Very smooth. No wiggle. A lot of uh, jumping or indentations down here. I didn't expect that. It's uh, unique, I guess, so you don't slip with your fingers down here. Helps if you can see the knife. Crazy, crazy amount of jumping up top right here. Hmm. I like it. I think the tan color is um, better than I expected. It's uh, I heard mixed things about it. People thought it might not be ideal or different than what was expected. But I like it. It's really shiny uh, liners, steel liners in there. They are... Uh, they are skeletonized. So G10 on both sides. Ball lock. Ball lock. Might need some getting used to for me. I'm used to... Ah, damn. Yeah, I got some practice there needed. A little slice already. So that's going to take some practice one-handed. Uh, the alignment is perfect. Very smooth. Smooth. It doesn't have that loud, uh, whack that, uh, eh, I guess it does. I guess it does. I'm impressed. I, uh, I like it. I don't know about the lock just yet, but I like the ergonomics, the steel, the looks. It's a, it's a wide knife. I think that's one of the reasons why I hadn't bought a Maddox before is that it's it was a little wide and beefy. There's the large Sabenza, so 
It's the only thing I have out to compare to. Similar in uh, length. Pretty nice. Full flat ground. Looks like you could put the pocket clip uh, in two different spots, basically. It's a uh, tip up carry either side. You can't uh, move it up here, tip down. Well, let me know if you have any questions. And uh, Look forward to uh, seeing some more of this uh, this knife.